heed my tale of time's beginning. All was dark. There was no sand. There was no sea. No earth. Nor sky. No grass. From this green came the giant Ymir, first of all beings. Proud Ymir, cruelly killed, yet from whose bones and blood and brains the world was made. The world you walk and war upon. you are. To fight. So nice having all of these hearty folk in our home. be worth two sturdy long chips. Give it here. I'll pass it on. My father asked me, Sigurd. Suit yourself. But you're not getting any mead. Valka Seder works through my hammer. <laughs> The ring? Good. This was worn by your grandfather in a battle on the northern way. Mother? Yes. Can we show Sigurd the can stones he stacked yesterday? That's a good idea. We'll do that in the morning. First light.
gift to deliver. Forever bonded in friendship and love. <gasps> Thank you, Eivor. Now and forever, I am pledged to you. <laughs> Hearken well in the Hall of Kings. <laughs> On ocean steed, my words gain wings. Then speed our forth will bring <laughs> noble deeds that honor sing. <laughs> the brave men slain, Valkyrie awakes. Rewards are strained to our little takes. And horns resound the mighty horn. are raised. Nothing is true until it is severed from the branches of Yggdrasil. my life. Will you spare my clan? You have my word. No. No, Baron. No, Aaron. Pick up your axe! No.
streams overlapped in the same DNA. Not sure why. Fix this or pull me out. I can parse the streams with a filter. Hold on. Okay, we're good. Are we? I don't know what happened, but I can work around it. You'll have to pick a stream to keep things stable. There's a third option, too. I can let the Animus modulate your identity based on signal strength. It's up to you. in and push ahead to a time where these streams are more synchronized. How long have you been chasing me, Wolfkist? Seventeen winters? Eighteen? Do I now haunt your dreams? Do I warm your loins? <laughs> you remember this? Ah, oh, your father sags. The weapon of a coward. A scorn snake. Ah, few things would please me more than to kill with this blade. But I know you would defy me to the death, fighting for a glorious end. That I will not allow. You will live your final days, enthralled as a slave, humiliated. Your death will be a lonely one. <laughs> Kill the rest of his crew! Make them suffer! Hey, the wolf kiss is no more! That name is dead to this world! You will be worth your weight in silver. <laughs> Foolish shit. Uh. You move, and I take your eyes, you hear me? Wind's blowing from the south. We can tack north, then cut west. Now, what did I just tell you?
save that for later. This area is off limits. Clash of iron. There's fighting nearby. 
Bag, you old hound. You live. I do. Slipped away in the sword clash. And what of you? Kyotwe tried to sell me off. A mistake he will regret. Not today he won't. I saw him board a ship at Aval's Nest not long ago. Sailed east, leaving our crew behind. There must still be time to save our men. I will find them. You ready the longship? You glory hound. You would take the rescue for yourself, so the victory song is written about you. I could storm the beach then. Slay two dozen men, seize our dragon boat and hoist the sail in triumph. Up to you. No, no, I will take the beach. A far more dangerous path. You search the longhouse for our crew. Oh, and here. This corpse will not have need of it. Go. I will meet you by the ship. Aid me. Kyotva's warriors crawl through Arvald's nest like lice. If I use the main gate, I may attract attention. I must be careful now. Have a look, Sunin. Crew should be inside. Must be blocked from the other side.
need to get on the other side. be an opening in the roof. My axe will miss your neck. Unpleasant for both of us. <sighs> you coward! Unbind me and stick an axe in my hand! I owe you nothing, raven shit. Yours is a clan of thralls and peasants. You! Lay that axe aside, or die by mine! You should be on a slave ship to Ireland, Wolfkist! But if you wish to be my first sacrifice, Odin will be more than happy to receive you. You just killed yourself, Erki. Meet your fate. I will send you to hell herself! <laughs> Kneel, Wolfkist, and I will spare your life. Shut your hole and fight! Die, you suck! 
work of shit! Father, you should have held on to this until the bitter end. If I give my life, will you spare my clan? Let it know! Pick up your axe! Kill them all! No! Us. What? Oh, yes, of course. Oh, thank you. Kissed, thank you, friend. Even if your wits were somewhat rattled. Listen here. If you can breathe, you can fight. Now come, we take back our ship. You do not need to tell us twice. Locked from the other side. <laughs> the other side must be barred.
Raggy, grab your oars. The whale road leads us home. Rhodes, it's about time. Stop yapping and start rowing. More sail. Sail down. for the mess you led us to? We suffered no losses in this fight, and the men who humiliated us are dead. What is that to say? Oh, something like, I was stupid, selfish, reckless, blind, boneheaded, and I smell like blood and shit? I like my version better. Eivor, look! Someone is setting up an outpost on that island. Shot of his men, gnawing at any piece of open land like dogs worrying a bone. Even with you half in the grave, we could easily take them. to row our way up. Sail out! Reef sail! Let the sail out! Yo, 
that will come for us now, harder and stronger than before. This war spun on for three generations. I hardly expect him to relent. Your hatred for that man burned bright, Wolf Kissed. I could warm my balls on it. Would you not prefer a pair of sealskin breeches? Just take care, Eivor. Such hatred can make you careless. What he did to your father, he did to all of us. You are not in this Run fight up the alone. Sail. What are you doing? Sail! Take Catch me the me wind! Let the sail out! King Sterbjorn will scold you for setting out against his wishes. Of course he will. Is that not something you worry over? I worry only that our king will not see that I'm right, until it's too late. What about Sigurd? What would he say? If Sigurd were here, he would be sitting beside you, wiping the blood from his axe and smiling into the breeze. And what will you tell our king about this misadventure? Only the truth. That we attacked Kjotve's fortress, killed his men, and weakened his control of this land. Will you mention the part where you lost your crew and were nearly sold as a thrall? Will that be part of your saga? If there is a skull to dare sing that verse, it will be his last song. What are you doing? Well, well, the feather of ravens returns, and not half. Hold here. Well, the feather of ravens returns. And not half dead. <clears throat> we thought we had lost you, Eivor. For good this time. A warm welcome as always, Landry. You look like red and shit. What happened? Nothing to crow about, except to say the men who delayed us are dead. And how are you? Well enough, though I have spent many tiresome days calming the rages of our king. He is not happy with you. I expected as much. And what of Sigurd? Has he returned from his raids? My husband should be home today. The last we heard, he was approaching Stavanger. Good to hear. We have need of his courage. Sigurd will not save you from his father's wrath, Eivor. You should know that by now. Did your raid not go as planned? They rarely go as planned, but we killed many of Kyotr's warriors, and there was this. My father's axe among the dead. Ah, after so many years. You should take it to Gunnar. He will give it back its edge. A good idea. After I see our king. That I do not advise. Not yet. He is meeting with a messenger from the north. I can wait.
A cloud hangs over you. Is something wrong? Seeing my father's axe after 17 winters, it stirred something in me. A feeling I've not had since the day he was killed. Since the day I got this. Memories of past agonies. Of sadness and pain. If I should speak with Valka. She could help me make sense of my feelings. Take your time getting settled. I will see you at the Longhouse. I think you have lost your edge, Eivor. Just like that axe. Maybe Gunnar can help you with both. I will let you know. Eivor! No big rough you are. Welcome home! I returned with a boat and a full crew. That is worth more than silver. That doesn't count! You need silver! And jewels! <laughs> Caught anything? Not today. The fish aren't biting. Too many passing boats churning the water. I lack the patience for pole fishing. I would have better luck with my bow. Shooting fish with a bow? That could work. <laughs> Shut up! Is the king free to speak with me? He is still with the emissary from the north. I would wait a while longer. Understood. I will come back. Well, look who it is. Practicing your wordplay, Albus. Ah, Eivor! <laughs> The only mouth in Midgard from which I fear mockery. You taught me the art of writing poetry, old friend. It is only natural that I surpass you soon. How about another lesson then? A quick flight. Right here, right now. What do you say? Let's try flighting. I always put a few coins down as a wager. Most of those who enjoy flighting have an equal fondness for betting. But today, we'll abstain. Let me begin. I'm ready. In flighting, it's key to match cadence and rhyme. It's as much about sound as it is about time. So be careful in choosing the words that you say. With your teaching, I'm sure my next challenger I will slay. Mm, no. The rhyme is good. But too many words upsets the rhythm. Now, let us examine meaning. <clears throat> In flighting, you'll need to be cutting and keen. It's about wielding wit more than venting your spleen. If I tell you you're foolish and stupid and dull... Then I will make a fine goblet from out of your skull! Not bad, not bad. The rhyme is there, the sound is good, but... Consider that I said you were silly, and you told me you would kill me. At times, it might be best to... remain on theme. Something to consider. Last one. So go, then, and conquer the world with your wit. Go be clever, be quick, show your spirit and grit. I look eagerly forward to seeing how you fare.
I will fly to you with flourish and best you with flair. Perfect, yes! <laughs> you could destroy me with such a line. There's still much for you to learn about flighting, but I'm confident you'll pick it up. Happy to help you learn, if you'd like to come back again. Perhaps I will. Thank you, Alvis. Eivor! Good day, Alvis. You return! <laughs> would you like to try again? I would. It may be I'll fare better this time. I believe in you. Let's try flighting. I always put a few coins down as a wager. Most of those who enjoy flighting have an equal fondness for betting. But today, we'll abstain. Let me begin. I'm ready. In flighting, it's key to ma- It's as much about sound as it is about so be careful and chew- You're a very fine teacher, I'm sure I'll excel. Interesting. You have the cadence correct, but you failed the rhyme. Now, let us examine meaning. <clears throat> In flighting, you'll need to be cutting and keen. It's about wielding wit more than venting your spleen. If I tell you you're foolish and stupid... Then I'll tell you you've nothing inside of your skull. Eh, hey, a good response. I called you stupid and you turned it around. Flighting about wit, you matched my meaning. When you think of too many perfect retorts, use the one that best ma- Last one. So go then and conquer the- Go be clever, be quick. I look eagerly forward to- I will flight- Perfect! You're flighting- You swing a fu- Thank you, all the- Hey, Tekla. What is brewing? Alvis tells me this brew is too strong. Think you can handle a few rounds? Hey, Tekla, what is Alvis? Show! 
Lord's drink, every one of you! Don't feel bad. Most of these backgrounds would have pissed themselves all past by now. Hey, Tekla. Out. Kissing a flagstone soon. My lifeblood. That was well drunk. Well done. Well drunk done. This land will never prosper. Who would like to hear a story? Trouble. Who would enjoy a tale of the gods? There has always been war. Even. Wolf kissed. Welcome back. Gunnar, I have something here you might like to see. Thunderclap of Thor! Is that your father's axe? I have not seen this beauty since, well, for some time. I forged this weapon long ago. Still looks good. One of my finest, I think. It has a blunted blade, but it swings well. Can you sharpen it? I can give it a better edge and reinforce the handle. And as luck would have it, I have one ingot left for the job. Are you sure? The fates have will it so. But in future, bring your own metal ingots. I cannot forge them from empty air. That should do it. Anything else? anything else and how are you 